The final race of day two will be the Cavendish Cup, which is a three mile two furlongs, not to 130, I think it was. Yep, not to 130. A big, big field for this. Should be a really interesting handicap chase. Miliana Sharag at the top four. David Robertson, Royal Ghost, Craig Beckwith. Among equals, Paul Rhodes, Hahira City, Darren Thompson, Love 30 for Graham Clutterbuck, Scarp Tree, David Robertson, Nicholas Silver, Kevin Minahan, The Beaches, Martin Lidham, Pink Gin, David Hooley, Watchtower, Graham Clutterbuck, Brockwell Park, John Morgan, Mon Via Vita, Stu Gray, Ministry of Science, Paul Rhodes, Tambourine Man, Martin Lidham, Rahi Tywod for Daniel French, Royal Wedding, Matt Cooper, Moleskin Jones for John Morgan, Why in the World, Joshua Sutherland, Caramere Trader, Derek Hinton, and Dock of the Bay most for Thomas Rogers, and Weaver of Dreams for Matt Cooper. So 21 then. Wrong silks loaded. Be warned, be aware. And also, there's too many for the track, so it would be an interesting one as they race towards the first, which is a ditch. And Moleskin Jones is everybody there. Mon Via Vita didn't get over it at all. So Mon Via Vita was a four at the first. Moleskin Jones, who is a John Morgan horse in the John Morgan colours in the lead. Four John Morgan colours in this. Two of them are his, two of them are mine. And there may well be some other anomalies as well. A very sharp turn coming up now, which is going to see some of these really well. And the Thomas Rogers horse, if it is a Thomas Rogers horse. He's going to be pushed well out there by the loose horse. Dock of the bay most as they get to the water, which they will successfully get to the other side of. This is a wacky course, of course, where we go round and round and don't go up straight until the end. There's a seven furlong running or something silly. We're not quite that far, but it's, it's long anyway. And they get to the fourth. And there's a fall of that. Royal Ghost has gone. So Craig Beckwith took the last. He's not going to take the last one of the day. He's out of it. Well, actually, he might take it because he's probably got another one in, has he? No, I don't think he has unless he's running in the wrong silks, which is entirely possible. Due to this race runner who doesn't bother loading the right silks up, but he's why in the world in the lead. Among equals is in second. Moleskin Jones is third. Then Watchtower and Weaver of Dreams dock of the bay most. Spread right across the track, looking towards the back. Nicholas Silver is just the back marker. Why in the world? He's in the lead. Why in the world am I still talking about the wrong silks? Been on horses about eight weeks after I first bought it up. Surely it could have been fixed by now. Why in the world in front? Moleskin Jones, Weaver of Dreams, Watchtower, Among Equals, and Hahira City. In Brockwell Park and Royal Wedding, as they. Make their way towards the sixth. And over it they all go. And over it safely. Tambourine Man was really untidy at the back and has now been shuffled back to last place. With Pink Gin. I think he's a David Hooley horse. As they go over the next. So they're all safely over. And why in the world in the lead? Or Joshua Sutherland from Moleskin Jones for John Morgan. And among equals is in third. That should be Paul Rhodes. Then Weaver of Dreams and Hahira City and Royal Wedding and Watchtower Brockwell Park is after that one. And then Miliana Sharag, Love 30, the grey. Nicholas Silver has made a bit of a forward move. Rahi Tivor on the outside of that one and Ministry of Science. Then the beaches is towards the rear. As they head to the next. Which is the water. And they all successfully get over the other side of that one. Oh, there's something gone down there. It's Weaver of Dreams is gone. Weaver of Dreams a fall up. Well, that one as they come into the next. They're all safely over that with a hero city and a more equal dispute in the lead. Moleskin Jones is third. And the 30 and Nicholas Silver. Nicholas Silver's made steady progress. Then comes Brockwell Park and Royal Wedding. Watchtower. Miliana Sharag and Ministry of Science after that. The Beaches is trying to get a bit closer. So to his sharp tree and Caramere Trader. And Rahi Tivod and Dog of the Day most. And the back two. Well, the back three. Tambourine Man pinching. And why in the world? It was up there in the lead. Not so long back. There's now dropped right to the back. And he's one of the bottom whites as well. So there's probably something to miss with that one. As they come down to the 12th. 
the Hira City in front. And Royal Wedding Nicholas Silver and Moleskin Jones in a line. And Royal Wedding and among equals Caramere Trader is getting considerably closer. So too is the Beaches as they get over the 12th. Because they're all safely over the exception of Miliana Sharag. That one's gone, so that's four gone there. As they head towards the next, there's still a mile to go. And they get over the 13th. And Moleskin Jones has gone. Huh? And Moleskin Jones went there or a fence before and I missed it, but Moleskin Jones is out now as well. And Brockwell Park has gone through into the lead. From what well, in the world? It was in the lead, then he was last, and now he's back a win second again. So I'm not sure what's going on there. As I take this sharp turn. away towards the next and why in the world is coming through to take it up again there as they take the fourth last which is the water well, it's got three more to take and Brockwell Park and why in the world are this there? there's about six of them queued up for third as they get over that they're all safely over that one just two more to jump down a long running to come don't forget this is the second last and it's why in the world have landed in the lead dock of the bay most is second tambourine man has come through from nowhere into third then comes Hahira city and caramere trader the beaches is trying to run around the outside that was the final fence and tambourine man's landed in the lead was a four foot long running longest running in racing and tambourine man goes to the front tambourine man from why in the world in second dock of the bay most is third then Hahira city and royal winning the beaches is still running on then comes rahi tivot and caramere trader but they're still what two and a half furlongs to go and tambourine man and why in the world two of the bottom weights are well clear at the moment tambourine man by about a length and a half to why in the world in second then back in third is watchtower and caramere trader and hahira city the beaches is after that one but it's now why in the world who's gone into the lead with a furlong and a half to go why in the world is clear and suddenly shooting away now why in the world is in front is this a hurdler running in a chase or well, what i don't know but it looks far too good for these and why in the world is racing away and champion trainer joshua sutherland is going to take himself another winner it'll be interesting to see later on whether this is a really a hurdler who's just popped into a chase but he's won that easily caramere trainer second nicholas silver tambourine man brockwell park and also was number 18 on the card it's got to be right down the bottom of the weights so Imagine that Joshua Sutherland's got too many. It should be down the bottom of the weights unless they've been running over the different code. When the world takes it. Caramere trade a second. Nicholas Silver third. Tambourine Man fourth. Let's take a look then. Final race of day two. And why in the world for Joshua Sutherland off 10 stone 5. Caramere trader for Derek Hinton was second. Nicholas Silver, Kevin Meanham third. Tambourine Man Martin Lidham fourth. And Watchtower for Graham Clutterbuck was fifth. One more day to go. We'll be back tomorrow for a final hoorah.